you want my girl, baby? Yeah. Now then, you sexy devils, this is Tarquin's mum. Make sure to leave God to for comments and a thumbs up. Otherwise, I'm not going to be happy. Speaking of not being happy, this thong is absolutely ripping me in half. And this butt plug, ooh, peace. Your mama, ooh, I didn't mean to make her cry. She wanted it up the brown eye and told me to carry on, carry on until she got my baby better. <laughs> oh, how the devil are we? Keeping safe, keeping sexy, keeping stunning, whatever. You know how we roll. Welcome to Gold Tooth Gaming. Put, put, put. Perfect aiming. That's how we are doing. So, on the last video that I did, I mentioned to leave any song you wanted me to do as an intro, and then I'd randomly pick from my mind. Whichever song I pick out, you get sent something. Now, the first winner, it was Kylie Minogue, I Should Be So Lucky. And it was Retro Red Steve, so congratulations, I've sent out his gift, so hopefully he should receive it soon. And yeah, this time hardly nobody put any songs down, there was barely any. So we'll try again, if anybody's got any songs for an intro, you'll get something sent out. Could it be you? I don't know. But I know if you don't put your name down, you're never going to win, are you? It's simple as. But that doesn't mean that I'm not giving nothing away on this fucking episode. I am. Now, let me tell you, I've been doing YouTube for quite a while. Now, some of my comments, the lengthy. Yeah, the lengthy. We girth, but we can get lengthy, and we are lengthy. Now, this guy had put me a comment, uh, I think it was called Martin Lord Waghorn, something like that. And he was sending me comment after comment after comment after comment, responding back. Really nice gentleman. He told me uh, he was going to report me to Ofsted. Uh, he told me he was going to squash the gaming community. I asked him who the shit stains was in the gaming community. He even answered. Who is this guy? I don't even know. But it didn't end there. The Rampage Talk, who I will leave a link for his channel in the description, got involved in the comments as well. And then shit got crazy. Yeah, it got crazy. It got crazy, comments got crazy, just for you, yeah, 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 oof, yes it did. Now, Martin Lord Waghorn, you would have seen in my last video, I got some Gold Tooth Gaming mugs, yes I did, well, I got some more, and I've got one with your name on it. Now, all we need from you is your address, and me and Tulk will come and we'll hand deliver this in person. Yeah, just leave your address and we'll be through and we'll, yeah. And I know you won't fucking put it in pride. You'll probably shit in it, you'll probably piss in it, you'll probably fucking put your cigarette butts in it. Or you use Tampax, whichever. But that is a present for you for having the longest comment on my channel in quite a while and having the smallest penis. So congratulations, Martin Waghorn, big up. Oh yes, it's there waiting for you, buddy. Now, we shall get into what I've picked up. And you've probably already seen them because I've fucked up. <laughs> but we ain't worried. So we picked up Final Fight CD. For the Sega Mega CD. What a game. Ooh. Now, I already own this. Now this popped up um, and it was too cheap to turn down. And I mean, everything is beautiful. CD hasn't got a mark on it. There's no way I could ever, ever lose on this. The price was that good. And yeah, I kind of know what it's worth. So I could always use it as a trade. Well, I trade, I usually keep things. But we've got it again. So that's Final Fight CD. Now the next one jumped out at me and said, surprise, motherfucker, here I come. And I'm like, who are you, twat? And he's like, I'm an old friend. 
my fucking old friend, fuck off. And he says, trust me. And I'm like, show yourself. And it went, boof. Mystic Midway, rest in pieces for Flip CDI. Now, I love this game. I've always loved this game. I've got so many memories of this game. It's unreal. And yeah, I've got this. But it jumped out sealed. It was like an omen. And I was like, damn. Get your coat, fucking sweetheart, because you're coming home with me. And I do believe that's the first time I've ever picked up a Philips CDI game. Well, I've been doing YouTube, because obviously I picked up my stuff well before I've been doing uh, YouTube. I think it's the first time I've probably picked up a Mega CD game as well. Same with that. Now, the rest are Mega Drive games, and they all bought from Doorway to Darkness. Well, apart from this one, which I'm going to show you. And that is... Gynoog. Gynoog Collegist. Oh, oh dear, what the fuck? It takes some licking. And it takes some sniffing. Yes, people. Do like this game. Yeah. So when I saw it, I was like, yes. Looking like that. Cover art on that's decent as well. There's a decent little schmop. I might be wrong, but I think I might have redone it for PlayStation and things like that. I think. Now, I've got one here. Uh, fucking Sonic the fucking shitball. What a fucking bell end he is. Well, anyway, yeah, I put a receipt in there just so I kept it safe. But, yeah, little one might like that one. He likes Sonic. And it's like a pinball. So I might give it a whirl with him. We'll see. But yeah. In fact, scrap that. It's fucking shit. I'm not playing that. Um, Sonic's pinball. This game I do like. And that is Tiny Toons. What is that? Buster's Hidden Treasure. Oh, is it true? Make a fortune playing a cartoon. Yeah, I've seen that one. Um... Pretty regular recently, but it never had a manual. And as soon as I saw it with a manual, I'm like, look, you're coming home with me. But yeah, it just seems a thing where at the minute, a lot of Sega Mega Drive are jumping out at me and saying, buy me, you know? But it's kind of all right that way because I feel like with a Mega Drive game or a cartridge-based game, when I buy them, because I always buy them complete, you feel like you're getting something for your money. Um, if I buy a PS5 game, it's like £60, feel like I've got nothing. Is it going to be any good in the future? I don't know. It's got to be something really, really spectacular for PlayStation 5 or Series X or whatever for me to purchase now. Um, because I'll just wait on and get them after the fact. You know, so instead of £60, I'll wait on. I'm not in no rush. Pay 20 Where these prices, pff, yeah, a lot of them keep going up and up. You know? So, might as well get some uh, more retro and besides. I didn't mean, never collected for PAL. Never. I never collected for PAL, so picking up these Mega Drive games, etc. at the minute, it's, it's kind of a bit of fun. So we've got Double Crutch. Oh, <laughs> fucking Double Crutch and Guy Noocologist. What the hell is going on here? What a perverted episode this is. This does look really good. Uh, I do remember playing this, like, years and years ago. Um, it reminds me of a Neo Geo top-down racer. So yeah, double crutch. Crutch, crutch. The double crutch girl on my list. Let me give it a little kiss. We've got Marco's Magic Football. Now this one is a game where I think the kids are going to enjoy. You know? And I might be wrong, but I'm sure they had a Japanese release, but it will not Marcos. Might be wrong, but I'm sure I played something really similar to this. Yeah, kind of looks all right. It's a Domark game. And I'm not sure if anybody's ever dealt with them before. Microsonic. I don't know. If you do, put down in the comments, because you yeah, have never heard of them. And tell them, putting stickers where they put them is fucking shit. Tell them. Get them told. Don't stick stickers on fucking inlays. Bellends. 
Now, the back of the screen's kind of gave this one away. I'd seen this a few times recently, but it will never complete. Now, I looked on CX thinking, hmm, is the one with manual? I could always have a drive out, see where it is. Wasn't even one on CX. But Darwin had just got that in. So, booger man. Oogie boogie. Mm -hmm. Oogie boogie. <laughs> yes, what a game that is. Honestly, I don't know how good it's coming out on CRT behind me, but pff, what a fucking game that is, honestly. So, yeah, for me, well, I'm going to say say it best till last. I don't think I did, actually, because... Probably my favourite is Final Fight CD. What are your favourite? Could be anything, couldn't it? But yeah, everybody, it's always a pleasure. You know how we motherfucking do. TikTok, 11 o'clock. Just some gifts and a cock. Peace, boo. <laughs>